Ephraim Kaemba and his 14-year-old son, Henry Chibule, are from Kalangala district. In December 2015, Chibule was diagnosed with lymphoma cancer, which attacks the lymph nodes. Kaimba had little hope that his son would be cured of the disease even when he was started on cancer treatment in 2016. However, Chibule is one of the five children who have been declared free of cancer after being treated at the Uganda Cancer Institute. The word cure in cancer is, is difficult to use because uh, what I can tell you is these children are cancer free and most of them have an over 95% chance that their cancer will never recur. But there's always that tiny possibility that will recur and we follow them over time to make sure the cancers don't recur. The five children walk down the red carpet in the ward where they once lay as patients. They each rang a bell as a sign of victory and received a certificate of bravery against cancer. Congratulate our children who have been through therapy because going through cancer therapy is no easy feat. But also to communicate to the parents and um, the patients that are undergoing therapy that there is hope that childhood cancer can be cured. Narisichi suvi la ntikansa haona. Era kubiri zemi ranga eri bechikwata kubona. Ngaba zade banange. Wabenga wale taba na mduwa lilo. They shared care with the other children who are receiving treatment. Uganda Cancer Institute receives between 500 and 600 children seeking cancer treatment every year. Around 80% of children with cancer can be cured. And what it will take is an expert who knows uh, how to treat children with cancer who can tell you in each case scenario the chances of cure. Director of the Uganda Cancer Institute, Dr. Jackson Obrem, says the children's healing is a big step in the fight against cancer. Given the right support, we can actually get 90% of them going home and being declared cured. The Cancer Survivors Red Carpet Moment was part of the celebrations to commemorate the International Childhood Cancer Day. However, the country still carries a worrying burden of cancer. On Tuesday, the Speaker of Parliament, Rebecca Kadaga, tasked the Minister of Health, Ruth Acheng, to explain when the radiotherapy machine at the Uganda Cancer Institute that broke down nearly a year ago would be replaced. Dr. Arem says the new machine will arrive soon. I can assure you it's not going to take us two months. We would have restored that service and even built modern facility here. The day was celebrated under the theme Together for Children with Cancer. Celebrants signed a solidarity banner pledging their support for children with cancer. Gertrude Tomosime with Kwari, NCV.